buds. Not bad, not bad. Might look a tad classier if you cut off the price tags. What do you want? Um, it's about Zhao. He's dead. Did you think he somehow survived that? <sighs> oh, know what I heard? I heard he died protecting a spoiled little brat and her stuffed dolly. A fitting end for a foolish old man. How can you? Don't you talk that way about him! You got a problem with me saying the truth? That's enough, Agria. It's not even close to enough. The lives of the Chimeriad belong to His Highness. But that old fool threw his away for some sniveling brat. That's true, but his sacrifice did give His Highness a chance to escape. Hm. He was an idiot right until the end. Always giving me candy when he saw me, like I was some sort of little kid. He just needs to die already. He did. <sighs> With Zhao gone, the offensive might of the Chimeriad has diminished sharply. Bah! I'm all the offensive we need! That goes for you too, Grandma. No one will miss you when you kick off. I'm relieved to hear that. Just you watch! I'll protect His Highness all by myself! <laughs> I'm getting a headache. How am I supposed to relieve this stress when there's no one left to talk to or have a drink with? So... that's it? We're never gonna see Zhao again! Does anyone else think that Alvin's acting kinda weird? Alvin's always weird! Muse certainly is easy on the eyes, wouldn't you say? I guess. Leave Jude alone for half a second and he always comes back with some new girl. Wingle, there's something I would like to ask you. Am I correct in my understanding that you led Ajul's armies at Fezabel Marsh? Using boosters to move through the marsh was a brilliant strategy. Are you mocking me? That strategy played right into Gillen's hands. You aren't the only one who failed to see through Gillen's facade. I share the same shame. I didn't realize someone who turned his back on his duty had any honor left to lose. Is that what you're doing here? Some sad attempt to return to the battlefield and erase your shame? How can you say that? Don't you make fun of Rowan! He's a great guy for someone who's so old! You were a skilled tactician in your prime, I grant you that. But how much of that skill remains today? Former Chief of Staff Ilbert, care to play a game? A game, you say? A mock battle, using a real military map. But of course, I would understand if you were reluctant to see how time has ravaged your talents. You don't need to buy into this. I accept. This board lets us control data from historic battles and see different ways they might play out. And what battle is this data from? Twenty years ago, on the Fezabel Outback. The Battle of Fezabel. The struggle between the armies of Rashigal and the former king of Ajul. Correct. It was a tragic battle in which both armies suffered heavy casualties from a giant tsunami. It was Ilbert the Conductor's one and only draw. And you wish to recreate that battle now? This is no recreation. If I had led Ajul into battle, we would have won. That is what I will prove here today. Formation Ichthys. All troops advance. The core of the Rashigal army is being pushed back. Left and right troops spread out to the wings. Surround the enemy's vanguard. It's no good. The vanguard is unstoppable. What is this power? That's Gaius's unit. Their first time in battle. You won't surround them so easily. Both wings advance. Circle to the enemy's flank. Planning to launch a counterattack from my flank? Such a boring and predictable response. I'll simply attack while your troops are changing course. This battle will be won before the tsunami hits. The enemy is turning faster than Rashigal. Look out! All troops maintain forward movement! 
Your goal is the high ground behind the Azure army. What? Rashigal's army is assembling on the hill. It's over. It is impossible to defeat a defending army on high ground in so short a time. Soon the tsunami will come and engulf the plains. You will have no choice but to retreat. <laughs> and this is what you call a victory? I am satisfied simply not to lose. I see. Thank you for the match, Conductor. We will settle this in a different way. <laughs> Sore loser! You did great, Rowan. It's because I failed in the past. If only I had used this strategy back then. I think it's great you learned from your mistake. You're still growing, even at your age. Indeed. And I still have a great deal more growing to do. I may even grow out of these clothes one day. Now this is some pretty nice gear. You really are cutting an impressive figure. You wander off again? Sorry to wake you, kid. You didn't. I can't sleep. So what happened with you today? What's with this sudden interrogation? You just have me worried, is all. Do you still want to go back home to Olympias? <sighs> Worry about your own problems, kid. Hmm? You want to protect Mila, right? No, she can protect herself. I just want to make sure she wins. I think that's the kind of help she needs most. Huh. So you want to stay with her forever, then? What? Al... What are you talking about? You won't have any reason to stay with her once this is all over, you know. I know. If you don't tell her how you really feel, someone else will beat you to the punch. You can't just count on destiny to work everything out for you. Fate doesn't have your back. Yeah, I know. I just... Maybe I need more time. You really do listen to everything I say, don't you? Huh? 
Nighty night, kid. Can't sleep? No. <laughs> me neither. You don't want to ask me anything about what I revealed earlier today? No, no. You did the right thing. The just thing. At least I hope so. Justice is a complicated concept. It means different things to different people. And what is justice to you? <laughs> I thought this wasn't a social gathering. Answer me, Maxwell. It is the power of will that resides within one's heart. <laughs> in this, we are both in agreement. Those with this willpower bear a responsibility to this world. The strong must protect and guide the weak. Gaius, weakness isn't an affliction of the body, but of the heart. The world will always have weak-willed people, but that in itself isn't a bad thing. Then we must protect the weak until they can become strong. That is our duty. We? Yes. All who are strong must look after the weak. It is the only way to ensure that future generations will have sufficient strength as well. So that's your solution to the problem I posed in Fezabel Marsh? As I told you then, I can chart a new future for mankind, if I just have enough power. But if a man like Gillen takes the stage, a man who can only use power for his own gain, then mankind will be doomed to repeat the same mistakes. I see. But I'm afraid it's not up to me to approve your answer. Your concept of justice is your own. It's not my place to interfere. <laughs> As you say. The two of you sure are alike. How so? No matter how extreme her words are, I think there's always truth to them. I get the same sense from you. Do you want to be like Maxwell? I wouldn't mind it, although I know that's impossible. I see. We should probably get some rest. Yes. The showdown's tomorrow. How do you intend to hijack a ship that's docked in the sky? We'll use the wyverns in the castle. You have to get there first. I have no intention of sneaking into my own castle. We shall march up the main road and reclaim it. What? You can't be serious! Indeed. At the very least, you should split into two groups, create a diversion. Keep your tactics to yourself, you old fart! Jude. Do you know what you have to do? Of course. I have to help Mila win. It's that simple. Then let's go. There's a path leading into the city off the side of the temple. We all stick together! <laughs> what shall we do? Let's see. We can take that side, then moves to the castle. 
From there, we can both capture the flying battleship and retake the castle and its soldiers. Meanwhile, Gaius and the others will create their diversion. Sure would be nice if they let us in on their plan for once. Anyway, let's go. You got it. Snowfall sure is getting heavy. Perfect weather for an infiltration. of arts and swordsmanship. I didn't do anything particularly special. Mm, that makes it all the more impressive. Hey kid, let's go. All right. Oh, it's freezing! There's so much snow, I can't even tell where we're going! What? Right direction or not, we... What? is this way. Thank you. They appear to be struggling. Shouldn't we help them? Uh, Their diversion will be for naught if we join them. We have to save His Highness. Don't let them lay a finger on His Highness or the civilians! People really do love him. If I'm not mistaken, your job here is still to help Mila win. That's right. Let's go, Leia. Gotcha.
plenty at the bridge. That it up there? Repel the hostiles! We'll have to fight our way through. If we must. <laughs> survived hit the showers fraud the curtain just closed on you I'm the new star of the show now thanks Ivor I'll rest I could use a breather no 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 this is all wrong now you're supposed to explode into a jealous rage uh, okay in that case I'll take care of it ha you think I'm just gonna let you play the hero You've gotten pretty good at handling him. Nah, that just kind of popped into my head. Well, he totally ignored Mila this time. Maybe he's obsessed with you now, Jude. But if he pulls his own weight, I have no concern. Anyway, let's go. Hopeless as usual. Quite a predicament. Can you tell us anything about these things? Now's hardly the time to chat. You're under attack. Well, prepare yourself for the yeah. rolling yeah. Huh. 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 Demon Fist! Huh. Go! Don't worry, 
Glad that's over. We'll take over from here. Gaius probably didn't need us after all. Are you unharmed? Yes, thanks to everyone but you. What? The ship is ours! <laughs> Let's return to the castle. Here, let me help you up. How long until we can set sail? I have every available man working to get the ship's systems under control. It may take a few hours. Looks like we still have some time. Let's rest until then. I wonder what those two are talking about. You wish to speak with me? You told me earlier you have a booster implanted in your body. Why would you do such a thing? Why? <laughs> if you have to ask, then you'd never understand. But you're still just a young man. How could you throw away your life? <laughs> the answer is simple. I await my opportunity to kill the king. What? That is your reason? Gaius is worthy of the throne. That is undeniable. So I was left with only two options. Resist or submit. You are a strong young man. No, you're just a weak old one. I have given a lot of thought to what you said earlier. 
It would seem that Gaius is capable of leading his people down the correct path. Are you saying you'll support him? Gaius may be Rashagal's only hope now that it has lost its king. I shall summon Rashagal's finest warriors here before the battle with Exodus. With your permission, of course. A wise decision. Are the others around? It's just us. You still trying to figure out why Zhao saved you? Yes. Mila and Rowan weren't any help. They were like dead guys tell no tales. That's not true! They didn't say it like that! Tipo's got a point though. When someone passes away, his secrets die with him. But... I remember something my parents told me once. They said that people who die are reborn as spirits. If that's the case, maybe the dead are always with us. Even now. We just can't see them. And that means we have to protect them. I see. You're right. Why are you standing out in the cold? Huh? What's wrong? Nothing. Don't worry about it. Are you sure? Maybe you should sit down and rest for a bit. Yes. Maybe this is simply fatigue. I'll take up your offer. Hmm? Feeling any better? Not really. But don't worry about it. Maybe if we just chat for a while, this will pass. Okay, sure. So, uh, what's the outside world like? Olympias. What do you wish to know? Well, stuff like the climate, how the people are, things like that. I don't really know. Huh. Is that strange? No, I just figured you'd know something. But it sounds like it's been some time since you've seen it. Well, I don't think it's a matter of memory. I simply just don't know. Hmm. Oh, don't worry about it. I was just curious, that's all. All I know is that Spyrex use is rampant on Olympias. Why would the people there rely on Spyrex instead of just using their manalopes? Using Spyrex is easier. No doubt the temptation was just too strong for them. I have a question for you, too, actually. What is it? Do you... Uh, uh, how do I put this? You sure everything is okay? You're acting weird today. The ship is ready for departure. Please return to the castle. I guess we should head back. Ah! Muse, don't scare Jude like that. Mila, may I speak with you in private for a moment? You two can catch up. I'll just wait back at the castle. Not with you? She's spending some time with Muse. So 
Sorry to keep you waiting. Hmm? That was quick. You could say that. The gang's all here. Let's go see Gaius. Hold on, everyone. Gaius and the others are taking this fight very seriously. We must make sure we are fully prepared. Yeah, good point. Come on, let me fight already! I'm gonna lose my edge here! Relay this to all troops. We believe the enemy base to be an enormous structure. All soldiers should review their indoor combat procedures. Yes, sir! I anticipate difficulty getting the word to everyone. Call in all of the relay team reserves. Yes, sir! I see you're keeping busy. Of course. 99% of a battle is won before it starts. So at this point, the fighting is just a formality. I leave nothing to chance. That's why I haven't accounted for your group at all. All I expect from you is a distraction. Should you die in the process, my plans will not be disrupted. What? Fair enough. Was that true for Zhao too? Did his death not disrupt your plans? It was not, and it did. Zhao's strength was a trusted resource, not a destabilizing factor like your own. He was a man who not only bested me, but even challenged Gaius one-on-one. -on -one. Oh, were you two friends? Friends? Ah, this must be how a child sees the world. It doesn't matter what we were. What matters now is that our military strength doesn't waver from his loss. You certainly don't make your emotions easy to read. You'd be wise not to waste your energy trying. The time of battle is at hand. Rest while you still can. Shigal soldiers doing here? I summoned them here, although fewer came than I had hoped. Ah, uh, looks like Ivor's still here too. That fool. He abandoned his duty to Neokara. Your Highness, perhaps a few words. Once, we turned our swords upon each other and fought for control of Riza Maxia. Today, we come together not as enemies, but as allies. We have already located the enemy's headquarters, a ship known as the Zenithra. Fear not the battle to come, brothers. United, we will not falter. Together, we shall reclaim our world! Launch the ship. <laughs> your, your Highness! We've detected a high-energy channeling circle surrounding all of Rize Maxia. Here it comes! Uh, what's happening? It's like my man is being sucked dry. I know this feeling. They're using the Lance of Kresnik to absorb the entire world's mana. The Spirit Fuel Plan. I won't let them hurt our people. I will protect Maxia. Make us airborne! Seem the channeling circle has no effect at this altitude. Are you okay? 
I've got an awful headache. Better have you looked at in the infirmary. I'll come with you. What's wrong? Where did Mila go? I do not see her. I'll go find her. There you are. I've been looking for you. Mind if I join you? Sure. It's funny. I was once able to soar like this whenever I wished. But I'm not sure I realized just how beautiful the world is until now. I suppose I took it for granted. Hey, Mila? We talked about this before, but when this battle is over... Yes? Actually, never mind. I see. Jude, there's something I need to tell you. It's about me. About who I really am. What do you mean? I never meant for this to happen. But in the end, I lied to you. Hey! Lover boy! Get over here! Wait, what do you mean you lied? She's calling you. You should go. We can finish this conversation later. All right. Something up? Something up? Look who's tall and mighty now. We found the Zenithra. So it's time. Dude! Bad news, kid. They say a whole fleet of flying battleships is gathering around the Zenithra. What? Jude, what was that? It was just like the Lambs of Kresnik, wasn't it? No doubt the Zenithra was the actual source of that light. And I think that. They put another hole in the schism. You're right. At least no ships were able to come through this time. Maybe they sent the men and they gathered back to Olympias. Looks like your fuel plan theory was right. It seems like the only time that I'm right is when I'm talking about a worst-case scenario. Wait a minute. Well, looky there! Enemy ship approaching! Everyone, brace for impact! <laughs> There's our welcoming committee. Yeah! <laughs> 
day's work. Good job, Rowan. Here's your reward. There's always room for improvement. They just keep on coming. It's on Aulia. Oh, you Luan, there's on Kitty. <laughs> That was incredible. I seem to have regained my powers thanks to your tethering. I never imagined you would possess such power. Of course, she's your big sis. I'm glad you're on our side. I am happy to lend my power to your cause. What are you planning to do? The mission would fail if the ship were to fall, yes? I see. It sounds like we'll have to continue asking for your assistance. Thank you, Muse. Take care. Be safe. Mila, never forget that you are Maxwell. <sighs> we must act quickly, while the enemy reinforcements are being blocked. We should split into two groups. I know. Do what must be done, right? We will put a stop to their plans right here. Our targets are Gilland and the Lance of Kresnik. At your service, Lady Mila. You again? Hey! Stay out of our way! <laughs> but of course! I shall join Gaius's capable crew. What? Think you can fill Zhao's shoes in the Chimeriad? Easily! Just watch me! Let's go. Guess they know a winner when they see one, phony! Get over here, idiot. How rude! But I shall let it slide. Al. What? Try not to die. Let's go.